I've never done yoga. I don't know. It's kind of you know, kind of fruity. It's not really me. And she said, no, no, no. Let's let me let me do some research. And so up she came with the cancer recovery yoga through Be Well, and it has been really life altering for me. I went for the first time and just fell in love with. Heidi and Mary and the group of people that were there. It's something that really carries me through and gives me a feeling of connectedness with other people who've suffered similarly. Hi, I'm Mary Baker. And I'm Heidi Minga. And together we are Be Well. We are a local uh, San Diego County nonprofit specializing in yoga for cancer recovery. And I had done yoga previously, but I felt like in the condition I was, I, you know, I lost all my hair from the chemo, lots of other issues. I didn't feel like I could go back to my regular yoga class. So this really was like a godsend for me. Be well. They were incredible. I'm a person who tends to be constantly on the go, just always busy. And it's an hour that I slow life down. It really helped bring the positivity back, my energy back. But Mary and Heidi are un- Believable. They have done so much training. They are considerate and concerned about anything we might have going wrong with us. And they really do care for each individual that goes in there. They started to actually know my treatment and plans. My doctors don't even know my schedule that well, you know. We, we often say that we're the bridge because when they finish their treatment and their you know, surgeries and stuff, their doctor says, okay, bye bye. You're, you're all done. done, yay. And they're and like, they go, well, what do I do now? So they come to yoga and they learn their new new now. And they find that community as well. It's so important for them to be able to walk into a room, take off their head covering or you know, show their scars and all their imperfections and meet people who are in the exact same boat or who've been there many years before. You well became like a really um, important part of my recovery was that it was a support system that I was able to go to and tend to and feel like I had somebody that kind of cared about me in the community. I love they always have a positive mantra and then the aromatherapy and a little bit of massage and it just has been really, really helpful for me. It's a donation class and you know sometimes I'm able to donate and sometimes I'm not. It helps with their insomnia, helps detox the body, helps them gain back flexibility and range of motion. Yeah, teaching them just how to breathe properly. Even my oncologist is telling me that exercise is the best thing to keep moving and particularly walking and yoga are the, are the things that come up as being really beneficial to your, your mental well-being and your physical well-being and, and maybe really overcoming cancer. When I come here I'm also learning self-love being able to have a shared space with other people who have gone through something just like you makes going through this tolerable. You shouldn't be alone in this. There's lots of people out there that want to help you. Before the class, they always give us a little quote. A friendly reminder, self-love is a journey, not a destination. I feel like the friendships will be there forever. When I come to Be Well class, it's kind of a reminder to me that I'm still fighting, that there's still fight in me. Because if there wasn't, I wouldn't be coming to these classes and being surrounded by other cancer survivors or patients who understand what you're going through. That's what we are here to do, yeah. is to make an impact in people's lives who've been affected by a horrible disease and teach them the skills to find a new normal in their life and to be able to spread those skills even out beyond to their family members and their friends and learn how to live life again.